course, yeah, I've been considering converting to Islam for years. Really? Yeah, since reading Malcolm X is a, yeah, I've been considering. And why would you convert? It's the religion that I resonate with the most. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. May the peace and blessings of Allah be upon you all and welcome to our channel. One day ago, we made a video about Snake O accepting Islam. And naturally, as a Muslim, you are supposed to be happy when someone embraces Islam because you wish good for everyone by the virtue of the fact that they are human beings. You wish to see them succeed from the torment of the hellfire to the mercy of Allah in paradise. And that was the case actually. But still yet, there are some recalcitrant fellows who rather doubles as doubting Thomases, or maybe we can say enemies of Islam, who went back and dig into his past history about some derogatory comments that he made about Islam. Yeah. And normally, after he started realizing the truth of Islam, he immediately apologized for these comments in a podcast he had with the three Muslim brothers. To these doubting Thomases, we would like to remind them the story of Osama ibn Zaid, the most beloved person to the Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam. They went to a battlefield, and when he came face to face with the enemy, the enemy hurriedly pronounced the kalima shahada, and Osama judged it to be the fear of death, and he killed him. He said he was not sincere. That the reason why he declared the kalima shahada was to free from him. And when they came back, they told the Prophet what happened, and the Prophet got so angry. And he asked him repeatedly, did you really kill him after he pronounced the Kalima Shahada? It's a warning to those, who, to those people who go around judging the intentions of people who convert to Islam. Do not repeat the same mistake that was made by Osama radiallahu anhu. He had also reported that when he made the comment, he received many threats in his DM from Muslims threatening him for making such comments. A lot of Ahmeds and Mohammeds are in my DMs. Um, and they're, they're very, they're, I'm getting a lot of death threats, personally. Um, it's normal for such things to happen, and it's been happening, and it happens during the time of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. And those who took it the hard way, the Sahabas who took it the hard way, the Prophet stopped them from doing that, which is supposed to serve as a lesson for us, the Muslims, that we have to treat those who come attacking Islam, or those who do not know about Islam, the same way the Prophet did. Not the same way the, pro the, the Sahabas did, but the Prophet stopped them. If we talk about uh, going back to, to dig out his history and the things he said before Islam, we want to remind ourselves and the Muslims of the hadith of the Prophet that says, Al -Islam, ma qablahu. Islam wipes away everything that happened before it. Actually, bringing such a video up is on the advantage of Islam. It's a clear proof of the fact that Islam is more than any other person else. Remember a person who yesterday was making mukri and against Islam. But that did not stop him from becoming a Muslim the moment he realized that Islam was the truth. That is what, the, uh, that is what Allah did to the, the, the companions of the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. The likes of Umar, Khalid ibn Walid. They were so arrogant against Islam. But when they realized the truth, when Iman touched their heart, they reversed what they did against Islam to the enemies of Islam. And that is what we should wish for, for people who embrace Islam, especially people who are this famous. That the way they make jokes about Islam, that's how they will make da'wah for Islam. We will leave it here for today and we will plead with you to not go away without subscribing. Turn on the notification button and share the videos. The same way we will invite those who are still sitting on the fence and they paint a funny picture of Islam in their mind and they don't want to come closer and understand what Islam is. Islam is open. We are open. Bring your questions, bring your arguments. Let's prove to you that Islam is the best. And we ask Allah to guide you thereafter. Wassalamu alaikum.